I built a massive marble pixel display last year, but it just sat in my basement collecting dust. So I decided to shrink it down and strap it to a jacket I could wear to open sauce. But the event was only eight days away. So the plan is to route marbles using these binary gates. And if I made an eight by eight grid for the display, I would only need seven gates. But I thought 11 by 11 would be so much cooler, which meant that I had to add a whole row of gates and figure out how to get everything to fit. Using interlocking TPU and PLA parts, I was able to print this whole flexible gate system in one go, which connected perfectly to the lower gates. I added these clear tubes for the display and this rack and pinion stopper, but I still had no way to get the marbles back to the top of the jacket. So I printed out a screw and connected it to a motor, and now the jacket can pump marbles back up to the top. I finally got this whole thing assembled, so here's how it works. The marbles are pumped into the two distributors at the top, and color sensors check if either marble matches the target pixel. Then it's routed to the correct column using the binary gates. But if neither marble is the correct color, one is dumped through a side chute and another is automatically lifted to try again. This process is repeated over and over, building the image one pixel at a time. To make a new image, the stopper opens up, dumping out all the marbles. But now I had to get this thing to open sauce. And when I finally got to San Fran, I was relieved to see that the jacket actually made it intact. Which means that now I get to wear the nerdiest piece of clothing I own to one of the only places in the world where it will be truly appreciated.